Das ist ein Apfel. Der Apfel ist süß. Ein Apfel oder der Apfel. Ein and der are both articles. There is a definite article, whereas ein is an indefinite article or unbestimmter Artikel. Let's see when to use which article. Hello everyone and welcome to our video series on Learn German for Beginners. In the previous lesson, we learned a bestimmte Artikel. In this lesson, we'll be doing unbestimmte Artikel. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for learning German for free and in the easiest way. We offer structured courses for A1, A2, B1 and B2 and a variety of topics from grammar and vocabulary to common mistakes one can make in German. Visit our page on patreon.com to get free worksheets, podcasts, transcripts, early access to our videos and more. Lektion 20 Unbestimmte Artikel im Nominativ To be able to understand indefinite articles in this chapter, it is very important that you have learned the definite articles that we did in the previous chapter. Now let's do a few sentences to understand them. Das ist ein Mann. Der Mann wohnt in Paris. The definite article der, just as the name suggests, is talking about a particular person, the man. That's why these articles are definite, whereas in the case of indefinite articles, just as the name suggests, we are not talking about a particular man, but just a man. That's why we use unbestimmte Artikel. Here you have to remember, when the bestimmter Artikel is der, then you use ein as the unbestimmter Artikel. In English, you have a or an as indefinite articles, whereas the definite article is the. Let's look at the next sentence. Das ist eine Frau. Die Frau hört Musik. In the first sentence, we are not talking about any particular woman. Hence, we use the article eine. But in the second sentence, we are talking about the same woman from the first sentence. Hence, we use the article die. When the bestimmte article is die, then the unbestimmte article is eine. Das ist ein Mädchen. Das Mädchen tanzt. So, in this case, when the definite article is das, the indefinite article is ein. Let's look at the case where we have plural. Das sind Blumen. Die Blumen sind schön. Now, since Blumen are in plural, you can't say eine or ein. Hence, in the case of plural, there is no unbestimmter Artikel. But when the article is negative, then the plural has an article. But this we will be learning in the next lesson. So let's see what we have just learned. Unbestimmte Artikel im Nominativ For masculine singular, we use ein. For feminine singular, we use eine. And for neutral, we use the same as masculine, that is ein. There is no unbestimmte Artikel in the plural form. Let's do a small exercise to see what you have understood. Übung. In the following sentences, you have to fill in the blank with unbestimmte Artikel. Die Tasche. So what will be the indefinite article for die Tasche? Das ist eine Tasche. Das Buch. So what is the unbestimmte Artikel for das Buch? Das ist ein Buch. Let's move on to the next one. Der Elefant. So what would be the unbestimmte Artikel here? Das ist 
ein Elefant. So, let's summarize bestimmte and unbestimmte Artikel im Nominativ. For maskulin, the bestimmte Artikel is der and unbestimmte Artikel is ein. For feminine, the bestimmte Artikel is die and the unbestimmte Artikel is eine. For neutral, the bestimmte Artikel is das and the unbestimmte Artikel would be the same as for masculine, that is ein. For plural, irrespective of gender, the bestimmte Artikel is die and there is no unbestimmte Artikel. Another thing that you should remember is that these articles are for nominative case. The further cases will be discussed in later chapters. Also, you can learn the unbestimmte article only if you have learned the bestimmte article for various nouns. To practice what you have learned, become a patron free of cost and download a free worksheet from our page on patreon.com. All links can be found below in the description. You can also gain access to our transcripts by becoming a $1 patron and to our podcasts by becoming a $5 patron. Danke! Thanks for watching this video. If you liked this video, do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you still haven't. You can click on the bell to receive notifications whenever we upload a new video. If you have any comments or questions, you can leave them in the comment section below. Tschüss! Auf Wiedersehen!